Blepharitis. The inflammation of the eyelids. What is blepharitis? Blepharitis is an inflammation of the eyelids, in which they become red, irritated and itchy. Dandruff-like scales can also form on the eyelashes. Though it is not contagious and rarely causes permanent damage to vision, it can be uncomfortable and prone to recurring episodes. How does it look on observation? This inflammation occurs along the entire eyelid, not just one part. The involved eyelid appears to have red inflamed margins. Patients can have mildly sticking eyelids. There will be sticky, matted eyelashes. There can be crusting on eyelashes. There can be tiny bleeds on removal of these crusts. How does it present in patients? Patients can come with complaints of red, swollen, or itchy eyelids, a burning, stinging, or gritty sensation in the eyes, crusty or flaky debris on the eyelashes, especially upon waking, eyelids that feel stuck together in the morning, watery eyes or excessive tearing, foamy tears or blurred vision that improves with blinking. What causes blepharitis? It can be caused by bacteria, an overgrowth of bacteria, normally present on the skin, like Staph aureus or Staph epidermidis, can irritate the eyelids. Clogged oil glands. The tiny oil glands, meibomian, glands in the eyelids can become clogged and inflamed, affecting the tear film. Skin conditions. People with skin issues like seborrheic dermatitis, dandruff, are more susceptible to blepharitis. Eyelash mites. Microscopic mites called dimodex can infest eyelash follicles and cause inflammation. Allergies, reactions to eye makeup, contact lens solutions, or other irritants can sometimes trigger blepharitis. What are the types of blepharitis? Blepharitis is classified based on which part of the eyelid is affected. It is of two types. Anterior blepharitis and posterior blepharitis. Let's discuss them one by one. Anterior blepharitis. It occurs on the outside front of the eyelid, where the eyelashes attach. It is commonly caused by bacteria, staphylococcal, or dandruff, seborrheic. Posterior blepharitis. It affects the inner eyelid, which touches the eyeball. This is usually caused by problems with the oil-producing meibomian glands. Treatment and management. Although there is no cure for blepharitis, symptoms can be controlled with a daily eyelid hygiene routine. Warm compresses. Applying a warm, damp cloth to closed eyelids for several minutes. Helps to loosen crusts and unplug oil glands. Eyelid cleaning. Gently clean the base of the eyelashes using a cotton swab or lint-free pad dipped in a mild, diluted cleanser like baby shampoo. Several commercial lid scrubs and sprays are also available. Lubricating eye drops. Over-the-counter artificial tears can help with dry eyes, which often accompanies blepharitis. Prescription medications. For more severe cases, a doctor may prescribe treatment such as antibiotic ointment or eye drops to combat bacterial infection, steroid eye drops to reduce inflammation, oral antibiotics, for more persistent or severe cases, topical therapies for mites, such as those containing hypochlorous acid. Prevention. Maintaining consistent eyelid hygiene is the best way to manage symptoms and prevent blepharitis flare-ups. This can also include treating underlying conditions like dandruff or rosacea and avoiding eye makeup when experiencing symptoms.